What do you think this means for the sport of bobsled for women? I'm hoping it'll mean that eventually there will be women's four-man since it's sort of been an unattainable event that we haven't been able to come to yet. Um, and that this will show that this can happen. Uh, Any last words? <laughs> That's not funny. Oh, Franklin, they're ready at three whenever you are. <laughs> Going to the turns and some of the sled, it, it just has so much more uh, glue on it, essentially. You know, you, you stick and you can put it exactly where you want, which was really exciting for me. And you know, they always say, once you drive a four-man, you're gonna have a hard time going back to two-man, and they're right. It was so much control and so much fun. They were some of my best runs that I've had here. Okay, we're practicing, practice your load. You had an interesting technique on your load this afternoon. <laughs> um, is this a new technique that uh, you're you're going to teach yes. the men? Uh -huh. It's called use the wrong foot when you step on the bunk. <laughs> yeah, no, I just completely forgot everything once we started running. So. <laughs> my best runs it was uh, it was one of those things that was so hard and so exhausting to get going that it was almost it started to get lost on us just how significant it was and when we were coming back in the car kind of turned the music down and I said girls let's take a moment to remember that even though we're all really tired right now this is a big big deal it was so much fun Bree was an awesome driver um, we just had a good time and we did it Thanks, <laughs>